Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna go ahead and pick some cards to see what's going on in this connection. How is your person feeling about you? What would they say to you? Where is this headed and more? Let's start off. You're reading my picking from the Gilded Tarot deck. Um, okay, the first card we have here is the Four of Wands. I actually don't do reversals. I actually think this entire deck is reversed. Let me just check. Yep, it was. Um, yeah, Four of Wands energy here. I always love drawing this card. There's just like such a unique energy to this card that I feel like is so different than the other Minor Arcana cards. I mean like this and the Six of Cups, Ten of Cups. Um, really, really positive cards. Perhaps this could be a Twin Flame connection for some of you okay i'm seeing that um yeah the, the sort of like forms in 11 11 and i'm seeing that stability is finally coming in i feel like for a lot of you you know you've had these connections they've been great but maybe you've just had a hard time like having it last or something will would always happen where like you know they stop talking to you or um maybe they have to move away some sort of circumstance gets in the way and let me just tell you one thing first of all you are not cursed okay so if you think like someone's doing spells on you or something like that you have to get that out of your mind because if you think that's the case then that's exactly what you're going to be um attracting okay i'm not seeing that's the case i just felt called to say that because i know there's so much um talk about like negative energy the evil eye this like you're fine from that you're free from all that okay i am seeing that the only reason and you don't have what you you know want right now is because there's something bigger and better coming your way and i mean like the better version of this person like look at how happy this family is they're you know standing under this um beautiful uh honestly i don't even know what to call it like it's sort of like pillar like but yeah you know they're under this like wreath which usually represents like you know um abundance okay a lot of people will put like flower wreaths on their you know the front of their door to invite welcoming energy there's this light energy around them like you are 100 percent protected okay and four also has to do with stability that's why um I, I really channeled that word that energy i feel like you are gonna be getting that stability okay i feel like you're gonna be with someone for the long run you're gonna be with them for good if you have not been married yet i'm seeing you're only gonna have one marriage and it's gonna be really long and happy okay so it's okay that things are not working out for you right now it's okay that maybe uh you know you have to take like breaks or whatever in terms of um you, let me backtrack here i feel like maybe there's been a little bit in and out on and off in your love life and and seeing that the person you really end up with, which for a lot of you, it really could be the person that you're asking about, you know, the first person you thought of when you started watching this reading, I feel like you're going to end up together with this person for good and you're clearing it out all the lessons, you're learning all the... Um, you know you're clearing out karmic cycles and you're learning all these lessons before you get married for real and it's like even if you have been married i'm seeing your next marriage is going to be successful like i'm seeing like after this you're only going to be married to one person or in a you know I, I'm seeing that for a lot of you, if you don't want to get married, like you're going to be in a committed long term relationship with just one person, okay? And like it, it's going to be, it's going to pan out well. It is going to work out well for you. I know you could be surrounded by a bunch of couples that, you know, just have their life together, have everything together. And maybe you're just like, when will it be my time? Trust me, your time is going to be like amazing. Like you are going to, I think, have like one of the best marriages, like not to compare against, you know, anyone else, but you're going to have like one of the best wedding celebrations, best everything. Okay. Like good things come to those who have been patient and waiting, not saying that you need to be patient or waiting. But trust me when I say like some of like the late bloomers, when it comes to anything, love, relationships, even when it came to work, career, they're the ones that actually ended up thriving excelling succeeding prospering in the end okay and i'm seeing that's exactly what's in the cards for you for you and this person okay so something big is coming your way something long lasting amazing is coming your way okay so don't feel like you know you're you know someone's holding you down or someone doesn't want you to succeed literally like there's no one first of all that wants to like you know no one's like praying on your downfall or anything like that no one's not rooting for this connection and even if they are they're not going to win at the end of the day true love wins and i really do feel like the both of you have a lot of love for each other you and this person you can conquer anything okay it's going to be you and them against the world here yeah let's go ahead and pick some more cards yeah we got the five of pentacles okay i'm seeing that someone could be coming from a place of lack i do feel like at times maybe this person feels like oh they might not be good enough or you know maybe it could even be their commitment issues coming into play not necessarily in the sense that you know they want to be with other people but more so that you know they just don't feel good enough for you or maybe like you know their issues lie in first of all they're kind of like more deep-rooted i feel like this stems back to their childhood or you know past relationships but you know they feel like 
it's a lot of pressure for them to you know commit right away but i do see that commitment is coming in but it's like if they were to commit like what if they mess up you know what if like they do things wrong what if you end up breaking up like this person is so attached to you right now they're so connected to your energy that in a way like keeping their distance at least for now again this is not going to be for everything is actually protecting them okay like it's protecting you as well and it's like um i'm seeing like their higher self is emerging their higher self is coming out of you know all these like lower vibrational things that you know that could be going on around them they're merging from this five of pentacles energy i'm seeing it's going to turn into 12 of pentacles king queen of pentacles energy here okay so um i see like this transformation this metamorphosis happening like i literally just imagine a butterfly oh my gosh what is going on wow there's like stuff flying out of nowhere in new york it's not even that windy i went outside it's oh my gosh that's insane literally like i feel like this connection is going to come out of nowhere i know i totally just cut myself out but cut myself off okay let me go back to what i was saying sorry this is so all over the place that's just kind of how i am this is how some of my readings are okay but i feel like there's beauty in chaos there's beauty in like organized chaos but anyways yeah i just envisioned this butterfly you know emerging out of this um cocoon here and that's what i'm seeing it's gonna happen in this relationship and yeah going back to the thing like there are things flying all over it's actually so insane i don't know where it's coming from literally it's not raining it's not windy it's this is it's the warmest it's been it's like literally 50 degrees today which is for february really really good honestly this winter has been really warm um for the most part but yeah i am just seeing that for a lot of you this is um you know this is gonna come out of nowhere like i every time i see something around me like you know something in my surroundings i promise you it always has something to do with you know the reading and like the connection okay i promise you it's not just for no reason but it's kind of going to come out of nowhere um this person is going to message you when you least expect it and it's going to like take you by surprise you and be like wait what the heck like i was not expecting this like you're messaging me now of all times right yeah um okay let's see what else is going on yeah we got the three of swords i i was literally going to pick like clarifying cards for this five of pentacles to see where this heartbreak sort of energy is coming coming from or sorry this lack energy is coming from and it's coming from heartbreak this person cannot stand to get their heart broken again i feel like they're like on the edge like even for a lot of you you're just like oh my gosh if i go through one more heartbreak again i'm gonna be pissed so you know this this, this is also kind of what your person is thinking and um you know they're also kind of just keeping back okay like they're sort of you know maybe hesitant to come forward just because they want to make sure that when they do come forward that this lasts like they, they do not want to be separable like you're going to be inseparable you're going to be attached at the hip okay i'm seeing like self-preservation as well it's almost like no that they're, they're trying to preserve you from you know their lower vibrational energy so trust that things are working out trust that your angels have really got your back and this is a very like guided spiritual telepathic connection okay you are being led to this person all roads lead to this person i feel like at this point it doesn't even matter what you do you're gonna end up together with this person oh my freaking god we got the star here wow okay yeah this person wants a future with you they are going to fight for a future with you at this point again like i said all roads lead back to this person the both of you 100 percent are going to connect like this is like it's quite literally in the cards for you. this person is going to be um you and this person are going to share a very beautiful bright future together and like i really do feel like this is your person like i'm seeing that maybe a couple of years ago you know you could have been stuck on someone else and you literally thought you'd never get over them and you dated a couple of people and then you met this person and you're just like wow maybe this person you know the people in the past were easy to get over and i'm seeing like some of those people you don't even want anymore yeah but i really feel like you know this person could be your end game okay you met this person you know all roads led to this person and oh my gosh we got the two of cups twin okay this is more of like a soulmate card here but yeah we got the twin flame and soulmate card so like i said you are connected in so many ways okay you're connected in the astral realms you're connected you're going to be connected in the 3d but you are connected energetically okay you and this person are going to share like a lifetime of success happiness abundance it is quite literally in the cards for you like nothing can stop this connection from happening i'm seeing even if you actually stop affirming you'd still be together with this person because they're just so like invested in you and invested in this connection okay yeah but let's go ahead and pick some love oracle cards to see what else is going on here um i'm not advising you to stop manifesting by any means i'm just saying like this is like set in stone okay as long as you want it to be oh my gosh yeah we got i'm working through my commitment issues i'm fighting for us they are fighting for you they're fighting for this connection do not take the silence do not take this like you know 3d period as like it's over like nothing's happening nothing's coming out of it okay there is so much going on behind the scenes okay we're literally only seeing like 
point zero 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 one percent of what's happening i don't think i don't know if that's the actual um percentage here but there's so much going on around us there's so much that's changing around us energetically all the time okay like if you were to like view the world you know the universe from like other perspectives you would be amazed at what goes on like if you were to like you know even just get into this person mind person's mind you would see how much attraction they have for you how much they really value you how much like they love you okay like think of oh my gosh okay this is so sweet but like you know sometimes like think of like a parent's love for their child like oh gosh okay, i don't know what being of this oh my gosh like I, I feel like definitely someone has maybe um th yeah th this could be like you know they're they're trying to like rem what what's it called heal their bond with their parents okay like i feel like maybe someone's parents could have like definitely impacted this connection or maybe this person you know had certain issues with one of their parents that kind of impacted how they view people and like relationships and love in general and i feel like they're healing that i feel like there's some intergenerational healing going on with you and with them i feel like you've healed a lot too you've literally broken i really really hate this word but like i can't think of another word like generational curses not that you've ever been cursed but like you have like you know healed through this generational trauma and this person's doing that as well and i feel like you've helped this person do that they've helped you do that and like all roads are leading you back together okay so this is just so beautiful i love that for you um yeah we also got, i know we'll end up together our love is protected you are on my mind 24 7 oh my gosh this person cannot stop thinking about you that's why you are also thinking about them that's why you are also seeing signs of them okay it is actually so crazy how these telepathic spiritual connections work um yeah like i had a client who um like literally okay here, here's one example you can check out my law of assumption playlist for a lot of manifestation stories but basically she had she was dating her you know, she had a crush on this guy who would like always watch her stories but then he kind of stopped watching her stories and then he had like a really interesting profile picture it wasn't even of him it was of some emoji and like she literally like okay so, so he would watch like some of her stories and then stop watching some of her other stories um she wouldn't i guess he wouldn't watch her stories all the way through he would only watch like the first one or two and she would post like you know four or five six seven like you know sometimes a lot and yeah basically what ended up happening is that like she was walking by this truck it was like a random truck in the middle of nowhere and it had like that emoji on it the same emoji that was on his profile picture and she was just like and then she checked her phone and then it turned out he had watched all of her stories it was so crazy and then like she even saw his name or like license plates which had like most of the characters in his name and he ended up he ended up watching all of her stories and yeah they ended up going back to like you know being you know they, they ended up like talking and they ended up communicating again so it's actually so crazy how that works that i you know i feel like a lot of you are really tapped into the universe tapped into like you know just like different energetic frequencies you and this person are connected like you're never not going to be connected and i feel like anything that's getting in between the way of you and your person being together is being cleared out i'm even seeing maybe there's like other people that you're not interested in that would keep hitting on you that just are not going to be you know part of this anymore they're just going to like not you know interfere with this connection whatsoever so yeah okay um I'm gonna end this reading right here. Let me know if you want an in-depth tarot, tarot reading and check out my website in the description box below. I also offer one-on-one -on -one manifestation coaching and I also custom make subliminals and I also do have a guide on my Etsy that will help you manifest as well. So if you're interested in any of these services, check out the description box below where you can sign up. And yeah, I will end your reading right here. Thank you so much. Love and light.